Here we go. Okay. Ready? Here we go. Greetings. We do apologize for the uh, lateness. We had some technical difficulties for those who are viewing virtually. Uh, but we're back on track now. So God bless you. We're looking at <clears throat> Revelation chapter 19, verses 7 and 8. Revelation chapter 19, verses 7 and 8. Read from, read from the King James Version. It says this. Let us be glad and rejoice and give honor to him. For the marriage of the Lamb is come, and his wife hath made herself ready. <laughs> and to her was granted that she should be arrayed in fine linen, clean and white. For the fine linen is the righteousness of the saints. Let's see if we find a letter to write this. Let's just look at it. Now, we, we, let me just go back for a minute. <clears throat> Last week we talked about, about rejoicing and all those things. Voice, uh, great multitude, but all in one. And now, it's a wedding time. It's a wedding time, y'all. Yeah, I've been waiting all this time. The proposal has been made. The engagement has been made. But now, it's time for the wedding. <laughs> it's time. So let's just look at the text. He says, let us, the saints, let us be glad. Not only be glad, but rejoice. Oh, my, my, my. Be glad, rejoice, and give honor. Hmm. Wait a minute, I want to back up a minute. See what it says. Rejoice. Let us be glad. And let us be happy. In a way, you shouldn't be, you shouldn't be sad. This is a great occasion. Except what you said, girl. This should be a celebration. Be glad, rejoice, be happy, and give honor to him, the groom. Who is the him beside the groom? Is the Jesus Christ. That's right. He is the groom. That's right. Be happy about him. Uh -huh. For the marriage of the Lamb is coming. Right. It's wedding time. Right. It's celebration time. Yeah. It's a time of being happy. That's right. Oh, my, my, my. And his wife. Wait a minute. The church, is, what you said? Uh, <laughs> let me teach tonight. Uh, <laughs> Listen to this. His wife is the church. Yeah. I, I'm not talking about the building. Oh, no. I'm talking about the saints. Right. Right. Because the building, when it comes, there should not, not be one stone left on another. Yeah. He's not coming from the building. He, watch it. He's not married the building. No. Amen. Can I just do a second or like? He has not proposed to the building. No. He has proposed to those who are in the building. And what's his, and his wife has made, has made herself ready. Mm. Wait a minute. You heard what you keep on talking. Help me, help me teach you. The church has made herself ready. Mm -hmm. mm. And all the time of waiting, she has been maintained her walk with the groom. That's, That's right. right. That's good. That's good. She waited for a long time and she could have got off track. But she made up the church. She has made up her mind that I'm going to serve the group. I made up my mind I'm going to serve Christ. I don't know how long it's going to take. It's, it's, a, long, it's a long proposal. <laughs> but I got to maintain my walk What I wait on the way. I can keep myself right What I wait. Woo, I just got look. I got a tweet. While I wait, I wait. Wait a minute. While I wait, I ain't going after nobody else. No, no, sir. Come here, y'all. Come here, y'all. Come here, y'all. Mm -hmm. You'll sit down and take so long with Shut up. I ain't fooling you. I ain't fooling her. No, no, no. no. I'm going to just move on. Mm -hmm. But the church is not, to, is not supposed to move on. No. The church is supposed to maintain, keep her walk with the groom, Christ. Yes. 
Maybe a while is coming, but but she's I, 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 I guess what? It's gonna pay off after a while. Mm. Watch it. There may be some distractions while I wait. But I ain't going to fall for those distractions. I'm not gonna be hood with the bamboozle. I'm maintaining my walk with the groom. That is not in my notes, but it's good. Ah, y'all want y'all got something else. She's ready. She's ready, y'all. She's, she's ready. She's ready for the wedding. Ready. All right. <laughs> Talk to me, Sister Mary. The bride doesn't wait until the time comes for the marriage. She be already preparing for it. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it's months and Sundays. You know, don't look like they go and do nothing. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? Yes, I do. But she's not in a hurry mm -hmm. to do anything. No. Because she wants everything perfect. Yes. Everything right. set like it's supposed to be set. Everything is on Yes. And, and this is just the way this this, this marriage is. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. We, we got waiting until he comes. Right. Yes, to right. get ready. But we already get ready right today. Yes. 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 You know, put aside everything that's not right here. Yes. You know? Yes. But that that great day. Yes. Yes, exactly. And you make a better point because what's the text? And his wife had made herself ready. Man. Wait a minute. She ain't just getting ready. No. She's been, she been no from the time of the proposal, she's been getting right. ready. Right. She didn't wait till the wedding day to try to get ready. Yeah. When you said something, Miss Murray, right. uh, let me see if I can find this real quick. Let me see if I can find something real quick. Y'all remember the story of the five foolish? Mm -hmm. Five wives? Uh huh. Let's go there for a minute, y'all. Ah, I want to start. I want to start. I want to start. I want to start verse one. That's a good place to start. And then shall the kingdom of heaven be likened unto ten virgins, which took their lamps and went forth to meet the bridegroom. Took their lamps. Ten of them. Uh, uh, Matthew uh, 25 and 1. Watch verse. <laughs> As it goes from here, it starts to tell the preparation to meet the groom of the team. Verse 2. Five of them were wise. <laughs> and five of them were stupid. Oh, it says wise. It says wise. It says wise. But I'm gonna say stupid. I, I, I didn't. It wouldn't. It wouldn't. I, I wouldn't just, just say that by accident. But they were stupid. Uh huh. Foolish and stupid. Watch verse three. They that were foolish, stupid, took their lamps and took no oil with them. Watch it. They didn't know when the bridegroom was coming. But they didn't, the, the five foolish stupid did not make any preparation. We don't know how long, when he's coming, anything like that. Right. They made no preparations. Right. None at all. Mm. Verse 4. But the wise took oil in their vessels. Wait a minute. With their lamps. <laughs> that means extra. Five, while the bridegroom tarried, lingered, they all went to sleep. They all slumbered. Foolish, stupid, and wise. They went to sleep. <laughs> I just got to tweet again. Be careful if you go to sleep the wrong time. That's right. What I mean by not doing what we're supposed to do as saints and kind of, uh, Mm, what, what, what you say? Like I like that's like that. Being like a day so spiritual. Mm -hmm. Not being mindful of your walk with God and maintaining your walk with God, you go to sleep spiritually. Right. Mm. And by going to sleep spiritually, you allow the enemy to distract you yeah. from being ready for the bridegroom. Right. Watch this. God, this is good. Yeah. Six. At midnight. There was a cry made. Behold, that word behold means look, see. <laughs> the 
bridegroom coming. Go out, go ye out to meet him. Oh, here it goes. Watch this. Then all those virgins arose, woke up, trimmed their lamps, ate. And the foolish said to the wise, let's go back up. Then what it says in seven, it says they, they, they trimmed their lamps. They did all that. When they trimmed them, they found out they had no extra oil. And while they were asleep, they ran out. Hmm. They realized in verse 7, they have no more oil. Then in verse 8, they asked the wise, give us up your oil. Can I just do something else? I can't give Lisa my anointing. Right. Oh, that's good. That's Lisa good. got her own anointing. Yeah. That's right. That's good. That's real good. She got to walk in what God has given her. Right. We mess up, we try to walk in somebody else's anointing. Right. That's good. You walk in somebody else's with somebody else's God has given them, and you can't be like nobody else. Mm -mm. Guess what? God broke the mold. We made you. Right. Right. Amen. I don't give your children look like you. Right. You are one of a kind. Yeah. Wonderfully. Marvelously made. Yes. Can't nobody duplicate you. No. <laughs> but you can't duplicate Christ. Yes. Right. I'll be better alone. That's in one of the Breast Friday's messages. Um, watch verse 8. And the foolish said unto to the wise, Give us of your oil, for our lamps, our lamps are gone out. Nine. Watch the answer. Good answer. Great answer. Marvelous answer. And I will call it, you can't take what I got. That's it. You got it, Joe. Mm-hmm. Okay. But the wise answered, saying, Not so, lest there be enough. For us and you. But go ye rather to them that sail and buy for yourselves. Amen. Mm. I made preparation for this. Mm -hmm. I did all this already in advance. I, there's not enough mm -hmm. for you and I. Mm -hmm. So therefore, go get your own. Mm -hmm. Now here's the catch I want to say. It's your finger going up. Okay, hold on. See movement. <laughs> it's not enough for us and you. Go back for yourselves. They didn't realize that when you leave, you may not get in. Mm. Watch verse 10. And while they went to buy, the bridegroom came. And they that were ready, I gotta emphasize, they that were ready. One more time. They that were ready. I gotta stop for a minute. Because you said that jazz, a song came to my mind. I wanna be ready. I wanna be ready. I wanna be ready. Walk in Jesus, like what? Just like Come on, somebody. Many that you and I have got to be ready. Yes. We gotta be, we cannot be trying to get ready. We, we gotta be ready. Watch the text, watch the text. It, it continues on. And went in with him to the marriage, and the door was shut. Mm. Eleven. After wait. Came also the other virgins, saying, Lord, Lord, open to us. Keep in mind, door shut. Yeah. They're late. Mm -hmm. Unprepared. Yes. Had no, were unwilling to make preparations mm -hmm. to meet the bridegroom. I want to say that again. Mm -hmm. Unwilling to make preparations mm -hmm. to meet the bridegroom. Mm -hmm. Watch this. This is real good. Twelve. Oh, listen to this. Listen to this. Listen to this. Listen to this, y'all. And this is Jesus talking, y'all. 
This is Jesus talking. But he answered and said, Verily, surely I say unto you, I know you not. Meaning that I don't even recognize you. You would all this time and not being ready, I don't even know you. That's a bad thing to hear when the bridegroom comes and says, I don't know you. I will submit to us tonight, are we ready? Yes. We cannot just be getting ready. We got to be ready. Yes. Watch 13. Now you've got it, Mr. Travis. Watch therefore. Here it is. Here it is. Here's, 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 here's the boats and the nuts to the whole story of the narrative of the ten virgins. Here it is. Watch, therefore, for ye know not, neither rather, the day nor the hour wherein the Son of Man cometh. We don't know when he's coming. We don't know. Amen. And as y'all hear y'all say it, better be ready. Our walk got to be right. Our talk got to be right. Our mind got to be right. Our actions got to be right. Our, what you said, our hearts got to be right. Yeah, yeah. But also if the heart is right, everything is going to fall in place. Yeah. It's the heart thing. How is our heart? Yeah. Is God doing work on our hearts? Yeah. That when our hearts are right, we can be right? The psalmist said in the 51st Psalm, he said, create within me, make within me a clean heart, wait a minute, and a right spirit. Right spirit. Right. There you go. And the church said, and my spirit be jacked. Amen. God said, I need your spirit to be right as well as your heart be right. You can't worship me properly until your spirit's right. You can't praise me right until your heart's right. What's in the heart? Right. Mm -hmm. I want to pose a question. What's in our heart? Yes. Full of stuff. Yes. Full of gossip. All right. Full of strife. Right. Full of malice. Yes. Full of hatred. Yes. Full of disgruntlement. Yes. Mm -hmm. Full of it. Yes. Create making me a clean heart. Yes. And a right spirit, God. Make me right. Yes. Hold on, let me go her first. Hold on. Go ahead, she's been so patient. I just thought in uh, verse 8 and 9, how in not what they did asked him to give it to them, but in 9, they said, Go ye rather to them and buy. Mm -hmm. And she said, well, You can't buy it if you haven't paid the price. Mm -hmm. I like that. All right. <laughs> I can't give it to you. I paid the price. Mm -hmm. If you got it, whoever has it paid the price. Yes. Mm -hmm. So no, you can't just say, Give it to me. Right. A price has to be yes. paid. Yes. Jesus explained, What's that price? Preparation. Yes. Getting, you know, getting ready, getting clean, getting delivered, getting, getting yes. everything. Yes. Amen. Yes. And, it, and it's a fight. Mm -hmm. It's a fight to be ready. It is. Yes. The enemy doesn't want us to be ready. Right. And you know what? We need to recognize that he's fighting us yes. to the nail because he knows that the Lord Jesus Christ is on his way back. Yes. And if I can distract you yes. and all those things, I'm going to get you. But I can't give this to nobody. Because this is a fight. Right. And this is a fight worth fighting to. Amen. It's a fight worth fighting. Yeah. Some, some tears and some anguish and all that. Paul said that I press yeah. toward the mark yeah. of the high point of God in Christ Jesus. Forgetting the things that are behind me. Yeah. I can't go back and get what, what I left behind. Mm -hmm. I got to be behind me. I'm reaching for the things that are before me. Minister Mary, I'll get you later. She, she's not worried. She, she's not worried about all these other stuff. No. Because she has a responsibility. Yes, she does. Do you know what I'm saying? And, and out of those responsibilities is the same that you know. Yes. Now she has to get separated from all these other things. So she, she, she knows it's coming, mm -hmm. but she's trying to get herself cleaned out. Right. Yes. Yeah. 
you know, to come. Yes. That he would accept her. Exactly. Because now, he never won't know anything. All right. See what I'm saying? You have to be somebody that's pure, with a pure heart. Yes. Mm -hmm. and, and all these things that you be the same wrong out. That's what she's working towards. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she's not worried about it. What, what, when he comes. And it might not look like he's going to come. And the people might ask, is he coming? When do you get married? Right. You know what I'm saying? Because that's what people do. Mm -hmm. But she's not worried about all this new stuff. No. She's getting herself ready for yes. it. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Because she has a great responsibility. Exactly. A great, the word you use, I like, great responsibility. Yes. yes. Great. Yes, ma'am. You do? Okay. 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 <laughs> and your hand up too? Yeah. Okay. Go ahead, Susan. Susan, you. Um, that's not okay. Yes. 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 Give me a clean heart. But I will follow thee. Yes. 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 Go ahead. Trim them. 
it would take away a portion of that width. Uh -huh. of the bottom of it. Yes, sir. But depending on how much oil was already All in right. there, there was a saturation in the bottom of that width. But the problem with that was is that that would only last for so long. That's correct. Before it ran out. Yes. And what I, I gather from this particular portion is that they thought that they had enough in their width. <laughs> That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. To, to carry them over. Yeah, 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 yeah. But when they realized how small the width was, uh -huh. they had to go and get more. Yes. And while they were out, they didn't realize the time that they had, had, had spent away yes. from where they were or yes. where they needed to be to, to be caught up with them when it came. Yes. But when they came back, they realized that even then, they were still too late. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And when, when the Lord turned and said that I never knew you, yes. was because you never took time during the process to preparate yourself or prepare yourself for this time. Yes. We, 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 we get in our minds and in our, our thoughts that when something comes up, is the time to, prep, to prepare for it. Right. Mm -hmm. But we also know that there's coming a time that we're going to need something. Yes. Right. And I was always told that you always keep a little Yes. In the back, because you never know when you're going to need it. Yes. And that's when you send, as the old song said, I'm sending up my temple. Yes. yes. You know, because you don't know when you're going to need that prayer that's, that you've already yes. sent out. Yes. And what they have done is they never took that time to prepare for when he was coming. Yes. And that's what that's what that, 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 that little smidge right there, where they cut the wig with him. Dealt with me with because we think that we can live off of grandma or yeah. granddaddy's or mama's or yeah. you know what I'm saying. Yeah. But we got to understand that we got to put we got to prepare and set some some aside for ourselves yeah. so that when that time comes, whether it's whether it's this time of tribulation, this time of a trial or whatever, we got to be able to go through and stand because we don't know when he's coming. Yeah, we don't. That's right. That's right. That's right. That. I'll see you. Let, 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 me, let, me, let me say this before I go to Mary, Miss Mary. She's next. Uh, I remember my grandmother. And my mother's going to witness to this. I think my mother's kind of like this too. Uh, she would have in the back of her trunk stuff. Extra stuff. I think we asked her one time, why you got all this stuff in the back of your trunk? She said, she tells me, you don't know when you're going to need it. That's right. She was prepared for anything that happened right. that she had. Mm -hmm. And mom, you like that too, aren't you? <laughs> okay, see. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Preparation. I, I don't know what's going to happen. Yeah. And I don't know when it's going to happen. Yeah. But I got something back in my trunk that can help me out when yeah. it does happen. Yeah. 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 And the same thing here. I don't know when it's coming. But I need to lay up some timber when it, in case. It, and when it does come, then I have my timber already laid up. And I heard I saw all y'all's hands. The book of Nehemiah. Like, y'all just dropping drop, drop, drop nuggets. The town was burnt with fire. He got permission for King Artaxerxes. I gotta go back home. First of all, he was, he was sad. Yes. And the king recognized his countenance. Yeah. Recognized his countenance. He said, Nehemiah, why are you sad? <laughs> Recognition. You gotta have somebody close to you recognize that you need some prayer. Mm -hmm. Amen. That, 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 was, that was an extra nugget, y'all. Yeah. Yeah. Extra nugget to do with that. <laughs> he recognized his sadness. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He said, What's wrong? He said, my city is burnt with fire. Mm -hmm. I need to go back, go back. and rebuild. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Watch this. Because he has connection with Nehemiah, the king. Yeah. He said, I'll give you permission yeah. to go back home. Yeah. 
Yeah. Wait a minute. He talks to the king. He says, "What well, I need some extra lumber. Yeah. Uh huh. To build. Yeah. He gets permission from the people who hold the lumber no. to get the extra mm -hmm. permission. You gotta have somebody in your life that recognize you going through, yeah. somebody. Somebody. and they will pray you through, yeah. and lift you up right. when you fall down. Yes. yes. You don't get nobody talking about you. You already down. Yeah. Right. You don't kick you out. You already out. Right. He said, he said, pick you up, lift you up. Girl, man, I'm praying for you. Come on. Yeah. Take yeah. my yeah. hand. Yeah. Let's go and pray. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> and that's why you have no trouble in the river, y'all. Right. Okay. Uh, <laughs> he was already, he made, he made already made preparations for the time of the war. I, I, I could go some more with that mm -hmm. in preparation, but I ain't going to do that. It's not, right. I don't know which one goes next. Miss Mary. Uh, I just want to say that this fine, this fine, this fine, this fine, this fine, this fine, special. Amen. Yes. But she, she's different. Yes, she is. You know what I'm saying? She's not like anybody else. She has her own way yes. of doing things. Yes. Her yes. own way of being who she is. Yes. Now, yes. her own way of waiting. Yes. For, for the big day. You yes. know what I'm saying? Yes. And she's grateful. Yes, she is. She, she, you know, she is, she has a heart that, that's ready. Mm -hmm. Now, I, I can't, I, this is just in my heart, how I feel about her. She's, when people see her, she, she's just different from anybody else. Yes. Mm -hmm. She doesn't look like anybody else. No. Yeah, she doesn't dress like anybody else. No. Now, I'm not talking about the time we people uh, elaborate on the dress. But I'm saying the, the inner part. Yes. Mm -hmm. yeah. I ain't talking yes. about the, the right. clothes. See, we working on this inside. Yes. You know, yes. Yes. On yes. That side. yes. And that's what makes a beautiful. She, she's a beautiful, beautiful guy. Yes. Yeah. And the thing about the wind, whatever that people see her, I look, everybody wants to be like that because mm -hmm. there's something different about her. Yes. Is it 
seven. Is it verse seven? Go to go to seven. Go to seven. What you did? How you were good. <laughs> Just made herself ready. Yeah. Watch this. I got another one. I like this one too. She has been given the privilege All right, yeah. to wear. Yeah. Oh, I'll be the wrong one. Thank you, God. She will be glad and happy uh -huh. and give him praise. All right, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the wedding day of the Lamb is here. Yeah. And his bride is ready. She, she's leaping and jumping now. She's praising now. The day is here. Yeah. Oh, yeah. is here. Thank you, Jesus. All right. Been a long time coming. But now it is time. Anybody else want to say before I go? Yes, ma'am. Kelly, kind of back on what Amanda Travis just said, I just heard it in my spirit that she was talking about the value that all of us have the value, which is true. We all value. But do we treat each other? Right. Yeah, yeah. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Anybody else want to say? Okay, let's go to eight. Let's go to eight. Now, before I go to eight, and y'all already seen it anyway, but eight is going to tell her how, how she's going to dress. And Miss Mary said she ain't going to be dressed any kind of way. No, she ain't. She's going to be dressed uniquely. All right. Nobody else 
Say the word. Right. It's designed, right. manufactured, right. just for right. the bride. Right. The church. Right. Would you say? Tell them, hey. Right. Tell them, hey. Feed it. Yeah. Just for you. Just for yeah. Can I can watch this? The church is yeah. the bride. Come on. The people, people are the bride. Not the building. All the right. people. people. Wait a minute. Don't, don't, don't get mad when I say this. The church has different sizes. Come on. Come on now. Amen. And because the tailor yeah. has already tailored your, yeah. ooh, your fine linen to fit you perfect. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You may look different. You may be all this in size and all that, but said the, 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 oh, the tailor. Ain't nothing to it but to do it. <laughs> so I'm going there for it. Because you held on, hung in there, I'm going to tell him make you a, wa a white gown. A white gown that will fit you. Particularly you. Perfectly for you. You. Yeah. I ain't talking about them. They're they not worthy of wearing robes. Yeah. But for you. You wear it to wear it. And wear it with pride. Right, yeah. right, yeah. right. Can I go this way? Just like, I'll see you there. Stretch your stuff. As you walk down the aisle, stretch your stuff. Go on. Bride. Right. The bride of Christ. Right. Somebody said a hand up. Oh, no, for you, Miss Mary. I just want to say that. She, she's, she's. Where did it, uh, sign with it because of God's grace. You yes. Know what I'm saying? Yes. Yes. And she 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 loves that. Yes. Yeah. Exactly. She loves it. Mm -hmm. My God. She's privileged. Yeah. To Christ. wear it. Yes. Yeah. Cause the stuff she's going yeah. through. Yeah. And that she maintain her walk yeah. with a boo. Yeah. She is privileged yeah. to wear that yeah. gown. Yeah. Strut her stuff. Right. Cause she's privileged. Yeah. Hung in there. Hallelujah. Talking about it, mistreated and all that other stuff goes on with it. Yeah. By hanging in there, she is privileged to wear it with pride. Yeah. Yeah. Woo. Go ahead. Yeah. I just like how the verse said, uh, arrayed in fine linen, but it said clean in white. Mm -hmm. Don't just wear the white. No. Are you clean? Yes. Yeah. Are you really clean? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Inside job. Because watch uh, this, I think you said that. Come on. I can look, look, I can look wonderful on the outside. All right. But how is my table on the inside? Because yeah. I can look, I can look good on the outside and be and perpetrate. Go on. And perpetration is dangerous. Yes. Yeah. Perpetrate myself to be a bride, but not be a bride. But I gotta be, I gotta be, I gotta be clean on the inside as well yes. as the outside. Oh my! Here's what one of them said: When she's preparing herself, watch this, preparing herself for the wedding. She cleans herself up. She washes herself. She puts oil on. She puts perfume on. She wants to smell her best as well as look her best. Because yes. the man is looking for his bride. Watch. Anybody else? Okay. Watch when Sister Karen reads this from God's Word. <laughs> Read verse 8, Sister Kathy. Said the right thing, had to work on me though. I didn't have to work on me. Yeah. 
in the process. It's a process. Come here, y'all. It's a process. And while I'm in the process, he's working on me. I'm allowing him to work on me in the process. And while he's working on me, he now has approved. I have his approval. I have the privilege of being approved by the bridegroom. Wow. Wow. Watch this. She will be given a wedding dress made of pure and shiny linen. Mm -hmm. This linen stands for the good things God's people have done. The good things God's people have done. The privilege. I can't get the word out of my, my spirit. The privilege. We have the privilege. We have the privilege of serving Christ. Amen. We have, literally, we have the privilege yes. of yes. serving yes. Christ yes. Jesus. Amen. Mm. Yes. What a glorious time it will be. I see you. That we, when the time comes, that we will be with the bridegroom. Amen. Stay ready. Yes. Amen. Stay alert. Yes. Stay vigilant. Because yes. we don't know when he's coming. Amen. Be ready when he comes. Yes, ma'am. Yes. Not that anybody else may not have a privilege. That's all that matters. That's all that matters. Exactly. That's all that matters. And, and you say that this comes to mind. And just humanly, we want people to approve. Right. Mm -hmm. But as she just stated, we don't need people's approval. Mm -hmm. We just read it. It's God's approval that matters. Mm -hmm. That's right. Because if we try to get people's approval, we'll mess up. Because they'll say some stuff that will mess us up. Yes. But we need God's approval. God's approval. Yes. And his approval only. Only. Yes. only. Yes. Leads us to understand that no matter what people say, right. you keep your walk. Yes. No matter what people say about you, talk about you, ridicule you, and all this stuff, you maintain your walk and stay focused. Yes. On the Lord Jesus Christ. Because he wants his approval. Amen. Want his approval. Amen. Anybody else? All right. I'm done. And that's enough. <laughs> I trust you have got some nuggets from this. I appreciate your input. Thank you so much. Uh, Brother Jayla. Yeah, this after this. This, this, this is in the list. There will be no vibes for the next Wednesday. Uh, one of the best things one. There will be nothing that we get to that either. Uh, two weeks. So we will. We'll, two weeks. Yeah. Uh, we will look when we resume. In two weeks, we will resume nine and ten. We get to the end of. Uh, 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 of Revelations. We get to the end of Revelation, but it's, it, as we get to the end, it's giving us preparation for us. It's giving us preparation for us. And I'm trusting that we're mindful of what we've been reading these 19 chapters up to this point that is drawing us closer to Him. That we're drawing closer to Him. You know, so many things are happening. So many things are happening. Rhonda Powell, friend. I know you're right, so that's why I can tell you. <laughs> and Barry Lord, right? Is it Brandy Smith? Smith? Wow. Yes, that's why I'm saying wow. Jonathan Ames. Ames? And Chris 
is for Miriam. I just name every next one of these persons are dealing with the same feelings. Different people, different families, all five of these persons are dealing with cancer. Then with William Brock. I want to say something to us. Mr. Brinder said something. They won't vacation, one of these persons. And didn't expect that to happen. I want to say to us, I, well, I'll say this afterwards. Samantha Clay? Okay. 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 She lost her husband. Yeah, she's okay. She's okay. Okay. Wow. Forty three. That's her age limit, y'all. Mm -hmm. Lindsay. Is it right about Lindsay? Um, I, I can't remember her last name. Okay. She's another person of cancer. She died more than family. Her grandson Derry died and Derry by me. Over Three points of bliss is dealing with your illnesses. The same. I want to pose to us a question. And I'm so just to agree. Another one who you said that uh, that's a really I think it's one of the next things for us, Sunday, Clifford. Dealing with something as well. This question I'm gonna pose to all of us if you even do us who are here. We have no time to fool around. I'm serious as I can be. We have no time to fool around. I got a list here. 75% of the people are dealing with almost the same illness going through. Going through. And as I said, I can share what she called me uh, just recently. Going through the same stuff. And to hear her talk, that is not like Keeps me updated on what, she, what she's, how she's doing. I want to keep her in prayer too. And I'm serious, I need. Yes. We need to be close to God yes. more than ever before. Yes. Things happen like that. Yes. That quick. We have no time to fool around. For foolishness. For craziness. this way before I start praying. <clears throat> I'm going to ask God to bless it. I'm going to pray for all, I'm not going to call the names individually, but all the names. Uh, he's His brother. He just got called today with him. His brother. His brother. And I want to pray for his family. I, I ain't going to call it your family's name now. Uh, but you know what? God help me remember these names. I'm going to call all the names by name, close to it anyway. Let's pray. Most gracious and all wise Father, again, thank you for your goodness, your kindness, your tender mercy, and all your many wondrous blessings you have bestowed upon we, your people. 
You have been better as we have been to ourselves, whereby we're glad about it. Thank you, God. You are everything. You are all in all. Thank you for tonight's Bible study. Thank you for the input from your people, God, that has enhanced the Bible study, God. Thank you for those inputs, God. Bless each one that is assembled here in your house this evening. Bless them name by name and one by one. Bless and meet every need. Strengthen, encourage, uplift, make ways. I know it's with this, your people, God, in the name of Jesus. God, I come to you and ask you to bless, God, the names on the prayers. I pray, God, you bless Rhonda Powell. Mm -hmm. Touch with your mighty hand. God, I pray you touch Brenda Lord. Touch with your mighty hand, God. I pray, God, you touch Brent, uh, Brandon Smith, God. Touch your mighty hand, God. God, I pray, God, you touch, God, Jonathan. Uh, touch with your mighty hand, God. Oh, God, I pray that you would touch, God, uh, Christopher. Touch with your mighty hand, God. All these are dealing with the same uh, health issues, God. Touch with your mighty hand. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Oh, God, I pray you bless Mr. Brock's brother, William Brock. He received news this today, God. I pray you bless the family. Strengthen the family, God. Oh, God, strengthen the family as only you can do. Move by your mighty hand and your mighty power for the family, God. In the name of Jesus, we pray. God, I pray, God, you bless Bishop Kenny Clay, the loss of a loved one, God. Give that family comfort. You reach where no one can reach and you touch where no one can touch. You do as only you can do. God, I pray, God, you bless the Gentry family, God, and the loss of a loved one, God. Give comfort to that family, God. Reach where no can reach, and you touch where no can touch, God. You do as only you can do. In Jesus' name we pray. God, bereave families everywhere. Give comfort, give strength. You reach where no can reach, and you touch where no can touch. God, you do as only you can do. In the name of Jesus we pray, God. Bless Lindsay, God. Touch Lindsay, God, with your mighty hand as well, God. God, I pray you bless Diane Morgan and family, God. Bless her grandson, Darion, God. Touch his heart, touch his mind, God. Oh, God, touch him in a mighty and an abundant way, God. Play, uh, God, touch uh, Jeremiah Newby, God. Touch with your mighty hand, God. Oh, God, move by your mighty hand, your mighty power for Jeremiah Newby, God. I pray, God, you bless Clifford, God. Touch Clifford, God, and bless Clifford's family, God. Bless them, God, and, 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 and strengthen them, God, as well, God. In the name of Jesus, we pray, God. Bless Sharon Walker, God. Touch and bless her, God. Touch her by your mighty hand, God. Move by your mighty hand and your mighty power, God. Oh, God, bless in a mighty bundle way, God. Bless all that ask for prayer. Yes. That even are not on this prayer list, but ask for prayer. Yes. Bless them name by name and one by one, God. Oh, God, touch with your mighty hand, God. Bless those that are going through, God. Lift the burden, lift the load, God. Touch in a mighty and abundant way, God. Open doors, provide for your people, God. You are Jehovah Jireh. You are the provider, God. Provide for your people, God, in the name of Jesus, we pray, God. Oh, God, I pray you bless the worship experience upcoming on Sunday, God. Be it everything be done and said, they will bring you honor and bring you glory, God. Have your way on Sunday, God. We be one mind, one spirit, one accord. Unifies in the worship experience, God. Oh, God, I pray you uh, fresh oil will be in the room, God. Oh, God, because of the anointing, Jesus. yokes shall be destroyed, God. Destroy every yoke with every stronghold, God. Set free, deliver, God, in the worship experience, God. Move by your mighty hand and your mighty power, God. Oh, God, I pray unison. Go down to the aisle of the people, God. Yes. And anoint a fresh God. Yes. Oh, God, I pray you bless God. Even our upcoming conference, God. Yes. Been everything be done and said, God. That will start next week, God. Been everything be done and said. Bless every speaker, God. Yes. Touch and give them a word, God. Yes. Bless in a mighty abundant way, God. Bless Bishop Jones. Yes. Lead him and guide him and direct him, God. Yes. As, as the president of the baptized Pentecostal Church of Homes, God. Bless and lead and guide him, God. Yes. Bless him in a mighty abundant way, God. I ask God you bless Sister Jones. Yes, Touch her body with your mighty hand of healing. Yes. From the top of her head to some feet, God. I pray you move yes. with your healing hand, God. You are Jehovah Rapha. Yes. Meaning, God, you are the restorer of health. Yes. Restore her health, God. Yes. Bless in a mighty abundant way, God. Oh, God, give Bishop Jones strength and energy, God. Yes. 
as he cares for her, Jesus. cares for the church. Yes. Oh, God. And the organization, God. Give him strength. Give him energy, God. Amen. Bless him mighty. Bless him abundantly, God. In the name of Jesus. Oh, God, I pray, God, that you will also bless me as I assist him, God. Yes. That you will lead me, guide me, direct me as well, God. Yes, oh, God, as I assist him, God, in the name of Jesus. Oh, God, bless him in a mighty, mighty way, God. As we leave your house yes. and go to our house, Give us traveling mercy, God. Bind every mechanical problem. Yes. Dispatch your angels. Rabbi us our God. We pray, try mercy, God. These blessings we ask in Jesus' mighty and awesome name we pray. And we do thank you. Amen. Amen. God bless you. God keep you. Till next time, blessings.